What's up, my pilots? Angry Poncho here. Welcome back to Let's Play Fallout New Vegas. Come to Mick and Ralph's for all your shopping needs. In this episode, we are going to bankrupt the entire strip. Every casino, every cap they got. Now, thankfully, the Atomic Wrangler is one of the less, uh, Mm, I'd say less affluent casinos. They are a little bit stricter about kicking you out once you've made too much money off of them. Uh, so you can only get about 5,000 caps, I think, off of the Atomic Wrangler. You're able to get significantly more from a couple of the other casinos. The Omertas in particular, I think, will walk, let you walk away with like 15,000. I went out the wrong gate somehow. I wanted to go out the gate over there. I always get lost in the free side. I know it's like three separate zones, but in my head they're all just one place. It's all the same place, and so I go, I go out one door and in another and I expect to be in the same place I started, and it's like, I oh, oh, no idea. That is strange. Anyway, if we head over here... Man, there's some anxious music playing around here. There isn't anything that dangerous around this part of the world. I don't know why the music is so... Ooh, right now. I don't know, it doesn't feel warranted. Oh, I went, right, I went right by it, didn't I? Over here we have the New Vegas Medical Clinic. Which has the world's best emoticon on the window. That reminds me of the face that they always post in the Twitch, uh, Twitch chat. In here we can find the genius Dr. Uzunagi. Welcome to the New Vegas Medical Clinic. I'm a fully qualified physician and can fix whatever is wrong with you for a reasonable fee. If you've got the caps, I've also got several implants available to enhance your physical attributes. Well then, what kind of implants do you have available? I have several basic implants available that can enhance your physical abilities, make you faster, smarter, stronger, that sort of thing. Hmm. I've also got two much more expensive implants. One's a subdermal implant that will make you more resistant to damage. The other implant induces a mild regenerative effect. Your wounds will practically heal before your eyes. Those sound fun. One other thing I forgot to mention. Your body may be able to handle only a limited number of implants. The healthier you are, the more implants I'll be able to give you. Now, what surgery are you considering? Now, the healthier you are that she's referring to is explicitly your endurance stat. And increasing your endurance here doesn't give you more more implants, but increasing it with uh, uh, intense training would. I would like to be luckier, please. If I implant the probability calculator in your frontal lobe, you'll be able to calculate odds a little better. That'll help me in blackjack. It's not quite the same as making you luckier, but you'll be able to nudge things your way more often. I can do the implant for 4,000 caps. Funny thing is, it actually does make you luckier. Have a seat in the auto dock. This will take a few hours. And, although it doesn't feel any different, we're now luckier. If we go into stats, perks, we can find our frontal lobe has been enhanced with the probability calculator, increasing our luck by one. So if we look at our stats right now, our luck is at ten. We are obscenely lucky right now. And what that means is we are going to have no trouble bankrupting every casino on the strip. I think I'll start with Gamora. Let the montage begin. Here's your chips. I got spurs that jingle, jangle, jingle, jingle, jangle. As I go riding merrily along, jingle, jangle. And they sing, oh, ain't you glad you're single, jingle, jangle. And that song ain't so very far from wrong, jingle, jangle. Oh, Lily Bell, oh, Lily Bell, oh, Lily Bell, oh, Lily Bell. Though I may have done some fooling, this is why I never fell. I got caps that jingle, jangle, jingle, jingle, jangle. As I go riding merrily along, jingle, jangle. And they sing, oh, ain't you glad you're lucky, jingle, jangle. And that song ain't so very far from wrong, jingle, jangle. 
Oh, all right. Sorry, I gotta walk really slow here from all this money I'm carrying. Ha ha! I gotta say, that was pretty friggin' sweet, man. So we just made a lot of, a lot of cash. 40,000 caps. What do you say we head back to the New Vegas Medical Clinic and get ourselves some more awesome, awesome implants? I'm actually going to save first, just to make sure. I think 40,000 will be enough for all the rest of them, so... Should be good to go there. Man, all that winning made me hungry. You're back. Do you need medical attention? Better than that, I want some more implants. All right. Let me do a quick test to make sure your body can handle another implant. All right. You're healthy enough to handle another one. Which surgery are you considering? Let's see. Which ones do we want? We've already gotten luck. Let's we'll work our way up. I would also like agility. The reflex booster does exactly what it says. Speeds up your reaction times. For 4,000 caps, I can attach the implant to your central nervous node. Do it. Have a seat in the auto dock. This will take a few hours. All right. Got some more for me? You're back. D All right. I would like also... I already got intelligence and luck. No, I didn't get intelligence, did I? I want intelligence. For 4,000 caps, I can install a logic coprocessor. To it. Have a seat in the auto dock. This will take a few hours. You're back. All right. And now I would like endurance. The nociception regulator modifies your cardiovascular system, and you won't tire as quickly. The price is 4,000 caps, same as most other implants. Do it. Have a seat in the auto dock. Oh, we're going crazy here. You're back. Do you need medical attention? I would like a perception implant. Can we do that? The optics enhancer, as the name suggests, gets attached directly to your optic nerve. The price is 4,000 caps. Lay it on me, sugar. Have a seat in the auto dock. <laughs> morning it was night when I showed up this is taking all night for me to do this we can rebuild him we have the technology yeah. all right I'd also like the strength implant please have a seat in the auto dock this will take a few hours you're back all right two left now these are the cool ones I'd like the subdermal implant, which will increase my damage threshold and make me tougher. That would be the Nemian subdermal armor. It's a bit pricey, 8,000 caps, but the implant causes your skin cells to be bolstered with iron. It won't make you bulletproof, but it will make you a little harder to injure. Do it. Have a seat in the auto dock. All right. And now there's only one left. You're back. I would like, All this right. is the last implant, I would like the regenerating ability. That's the Phoenix Monocyte Breeder. The implant speeds up cell regeneration, an effect similar to that of some lizards and sea creatures. The implant is very expensive, however. 12,000 caps. I got the money. Have a seat in the auto dock. This will take a few hours. As it turns out, I think I have like exactly the right amount of money, too. <laughs> Let me check here. Yes, I have 651 caps left, which is about as much as I had when I walked into Vegas. So we walked into Vegas with just a few bucks in our pocket, walked out with enough money to buy <laughs> eight perks, or eight different implants. The agility implant, we got the reflex booster, we got the nociception regulator, the logic coprocessor, the probability calculator, the phoenix monocyte breeder, the optics enhancer, the Hypertrophy Accelerator and the Nemean Subdermal Armor. All of which are pretty freaking awesome. Alright, oh, so while while we, all that fun stuff was going on, when I walked into the tops, it updated a quest. It actually finished the quest, They Went that away, Which is the quest that tells you to search around in the south part of town 
in the south part of uh, the world, actually, and find your way around to that eventually leads you to Vegas. Now, since I walked, as soon as walk, you walk into the tops, you trigger it. So basically, there's no way to bankrupt the strip without finishing it. We still will, will be able to talk to all the people in this quest, and we still will be able to get the information, but we won't get the experience because we already got it. So now we're going to head back to Good Springs. But basically, when I walked into the, the tops, it gave me like a thousand experience points or something like that. And so I was got enough experience to go right up to level 4. I love the way the saloon looks at night. That's actually the background on my phone right now. See, it's actually dark at night? Nice, right? You know, some stuff, some stuff that's close by, like this truck, you can just barely see, but the rest of it's just dark. I like it, man. I like it a lot. So, I'm going to go ahead and put in the, uh, the bits for where I got those two level ups, and I'll show you the skills I took and whatnot. So as soon as you walk in, you get all this experience. We'll take it to level three. I looked at all the music here. I just I couldn't deny you guys. I want to put four points into repair, and I want to put ten points into survival. And I'm going to take intense training for endurance this time. We had intelligence last time, and now endurance. And now at level four. Gotta love that music. I'm going to put all the points into middle weapons, and I'm going to accidentally and very stupidly take the confirmed bachelor perk. Whoops. We'll get educated next level. Alrighty then. And, uh, I think that is about it. I, I do have all of the recordings of, uh, what, what the people in the casinos will say as you slowly but surely bankrupt them. So I'll go ahead and put in the dialogue for the, uh, the last, the last one that they say. All the earlier ones are just, hey, we like you. Basically the bonuses that you get are, you get the Bon Vivant Sweet Key, and you get, uh, Executive Sweet Key for Ultra Lux and for the Tops. And so you have places to sleep in Vegas when you go there. And then at the end of this video, afterwards, I'll, I'll put in the dialogue for... Actually, we'll do it here. Let's go ahead and do the, the three different casinos kicking us out. Okay, that's that. No more games for you. Go rob the tops. You're done here. Have some drinks, talk to some dancers, but you are done at my tables. This simply will not do. You must leave immediately. You're still welcome to dine with us, of course. We've just had quite enough of paying you to play our games. Okay, pal, you've had enough. Time for you to leave. You've taken us for a ride, and we want you out. You're free to enjoy the shows in the bar, but no more games for you at the tops. Thanks for playing. And that was that. We have now had an awesome run with our naughty nightwear, but I'm going to go ahead and put on my real armor again. We actually got some combat armor as one of the rewards. And we are going to... I'm going to wear that, actually. We are going to get back to business in the next episode of Let's Play Fallout New Vegas. Thanks for watching. See you guys then.